What's up guys, Evil Deer here, and I'm back for some more Esperanto slash World of Warcraft. Now, I mentioned this in the previous um, vlog which I did in Esperanto, so if you didn't get this, I'm just going to give it to you now. Basically, I have changed the way I'm doing my videos. Um, so basically, uh, Saturdays and Sundays will be gaming, no, sorry, Sundays will be gaming videos, and um, also Tuesdays and Fridays. Yeah, I believe that's right. Anyway, I'm, I'm building like a little schedule type of thing. Now, you've probably noticed that I look slightly different. I'm no longer a Tauren. Well, I'm actually just playing my other character today because uh, some of you guys um, mentioned that you're just getting a bit tired of just seeing me running around killing mobs. So I figured I'd do this Esperanto lesson while playing a Battleground, and then maybe next time I'll do one in the dungeon. Just kind of like jump us ahead character-wise, just to, just to give us something new to do type of thing. Anyway, so let's begin with the actual lesson. So first up, and this is going to be interesting because I'm going to be trying to save people and keep them alive while teaching you. So what was the word for scout? Now when I say what was the word, I mean the traditional word, not the one built from the verb. It was skulto. Skulto. And do you guys remember the word for um, scout but built from the verb? It was esplodisto. Esplodisto. And what was the verb to explore? It was esplori, esplori. And do you remember how to say to see? It was vidi, vidi. Um, and how do you say at the base of the tower? C'è la base del turo. C'è la base del turo. Okay. Awesome. Let's begin. Okay, so I am still a healer, just like with my other character, except now I'm uh, just a higher level. I'm actually only 46, so not that much more impressive. Anyway, let's get into battle. So, let's have a look. What we got? We got the enemy over that way. I'm going to hang around with that dude. He looks high level. Okay, and what was the word for spider? It was araneo. Araneo. And do you remember how to say something? It was io. Io. And what about, how would you say he stands at the base of the tower? Li stardas ce la baso del turo. Oh, no, no speed boots there. There's like a little buff you can get there which makes you run faster, but you should only grab it after you get the flag. Oh, by the way, that's the objective of this battle. We're fighting against other players, and the objective is to basically get the flag and win the game. Uh, you got to do it three times. Okay, and how would you say um, he sees the enemy? Li vidas la malamikon. And in fact, he doesn't actually see the enemy. I don't see the enemy anywhere. But we're all grouped up here, so we're, we're pretty safe. Okay, I'm going to teach you the word for that, by the way. So the word for group is grupo. Grupo. So to say we are a group, what do you think you would say, based on what I've taught you in the past? Ni estas grupo. Ni estas grupo. I'm just going to check out and see what these guys are up to. Okay, I'm going to protect this guy because I'm going to keep him alive because that's my job. I'm a healer and the word for a healer in this game is actually a priest. So I'm going to teach you both of those words. So the word for priest is pastro, pastro. Okay, oh, oh, come on, come on, come on, come on. Can I get that? Eh. Yeah. Oh, it's a thumb down for some reason. Okay, I'm going to head back this way. I'm still getting used to all the new stuff in this game because it's been ages since I played it. Okay, and so the word for priest is pastoral, but I'm actually a healer, so my job is to heal people. So the word um, for health is sano, sano, okay? Now if you want to turn that into a verb, you'd think naturally, you'd say sani, but sani is actually an intransitive verb and it means to be healthy. Oh, this is going to get crazy. Okay, so I'm going to heal him, because that's my job in here. So, me, the way you would say that, you'd say, me sanigas lin, because remember how I taught you before that 
Oh, I'm under heavy attack. So remember how I taught you before that um, the Iggy at a verb, it means uh, to do, so to do the verb, whatever it may be. Oh, shivers me, timbers. So I have to heal myself. So, um, mi sanigas min. Mi sanigas min. <laughs> you got nothing against me, mate. I'm awesome. Okay, and I'm going to teach you the word for um, must, okay? So the way to say must is devas, devas. So to say that, you'd say, um, to say I must heal myself, you'd say mi devas sanigi min. Mi devas sanigi min. And how would you think you'd say um, I must heal my friend? Mi deva sanigi mi anamiko. Oh, but in this case, I must heal myself. Mi deva sanigi min. Oh man, this guy is going all out on me. You've got nothing, mate. So how would you then say he must kill me? Li devas modetigi min. Li devas modetigi min. And how would you say? His priest must heal him. Lia pastro devas sanigi lin. Man, these guys are just going crazy on me. Okay, I'm going to try and just get away from him. No, nah, that didn't work very well. <laughs> oh, come on. How many people are on me? Jesus. Oh, this is getting really crazy right now. I can't believe these guys are so bad. What is my dude doing? He's running around in a circle, basically, the entire time. That's all he's been doing. Okay, so I'm now a sheep. So I was just a sheep. So the word for sheep is shuffle. Shuffle. And the way to say, um, he sheeped me, <laughs> because that's what you do when you, you polymorph someone in this game, which is you basically turn them into a sheep. So, ah, oh, bugger me, Timbers. They actually killed my guy. Because it's just me, a healer, versus all them. So, he turned me into a sheep. I would actually say, Li Shafigis Min. Li Shafigis Min. Because that's what he did. He turned me into a sheep. Oh my god, this... This guy is just going to follow me around and try to kill me the whole time. <laughs> this is a real challenge, teaching you guys these words. Okay, so... Again, like I said before, the standard way to say a priest in this game is pastro, but I'm actually a healer. So a healer is someone who obviously causes someone to be healed. So that would be sanigi. And this guy is a freaking idiot. He turned me into a sheep, so li shafigis min. But he doesn't realize that when you do that, you actually increase the person's health, like respawn rate. So he basically just like defeated the whole purpose. Unless he just wanted to shafigi min so that he could run away, so that he could fuji. So how would you say he um, wants to turn me into a sheep because he wants to uh, flee? Let's see if you can do all that. Li volas shafigi min chad. Li volas fuji. Li volas shafigi min chad li volas fuji. And that thing is so annoying. It slows you down massively. Oh, I want to help my guys. Okay, let's get on my horse. Or it's not actually a horse. It's a deer. So what was the word for deer? It was tsurvo. Tsurvo. Okay, okay, I need to heal him. So how do we say, I must heal him? Mi devas sanigi lin. Mi devas sanigi lin. Okay, awesome. Apparently I'm still in combat, so I can't get... What in God's earth is that type of mount? That is a crazy mount. Okay, that is an insect. Um, I think it's an insect. Some type of creature like that. So the word for insect is insecto. Insecto. Pretty easy to remember because it sounds like the English word. So, is that guy an enemy? No, he's a friend. Okay, cool, cool. Okay, so 
we're going to learn um, a little bit more with the accusative case. Now, this is going to be interesting because I am currently going to be in a massive battle in a second. So let's see if we can do this. Oh, oh, oh. Okay, so the way to say where, as you already know, is kie, kie. Okay, now if you want to say um, where are you going, you'd say kien vi iras. Okay, now you notice I put the accusative actually onto the where, which is kie. And the reason I did that is because, oh come on, I got it. Mi deva san igilin, mi deva san igilin, mi deva san. Ah, feck. Okay, that's not good. That is not good at all. Okay, so how would we say they want to kill me? Ili valas modetigimen. Ili valas modetigimen. Oh, come on. Why is everything... No! Mine valas ke vi modetigumen. I just totally taught you some new stuff that you didn't even know. Okay, so let's just, um, let's just focus on what I just taught you, okay? <laughs> so, the word, um, ke means, um, that, okay? So, if you say, um, mine volas, it means I don't want, and... Mine volas ke means I don't want that. Vi modetigumin. It means I don't want that you kill me, okay? And you notice how it's actually. Um, oh, I've got to really save my guy right now. Oh, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Don't run away. Mi deva savivin. So. Oh, damn it. I'm going into the hut. I'm going into the hut. Mi en iras la domon. Mi en iras la domon. And bus, yes, you got nothing, mate. You got nothing. <laughs> so, to say I, um, oh, is that guy an enemy? He is. Ah. Uh, okay. To say um, I don't want you to kill me, you'd say me, me ne volas ke vi moditigu min. So how would you say I don't want you um, to? Let's think of. Wash me, okay? That's a verb we learnt. Mi ne volas ke vi lavu min. Mi ne volas ke vi lavu min. So, how would you say, I don't want you to kill me? Mi ne volas ke vi Modetigu min. And what you're doing here is when you're saying that, um, when you're joining two sentences like that, you'll notice that you use. <laughs> she just got owned bad. <laughs> that was awesome, mate. Good work. <laughs> so, how would you say he just killed her? Okay, I haven't taught you just, so I'm going to teach you that right now. So, the word for just is jus. Jus, okay? So, he just killed her is. Li jus modetigi shin. Now I know I'm throwing lots of random stuff at you, but that's cool because I plan to do more of these lessons where we're in PvP, and of course we're going to be repeating the same words over and over until they're ingrained into your little caps, your little heads. Um, <laughs> so yeah, don't don't thread if you're not getting all this right now because even I'm not getting it all. I'm just kind of all over the shop. So yeah, how would you say um, he just uh, healed me? Li jus sanigis min. Li jus sanigis min. And I'm gonna heal him. Mi nun sanigas lin. What does that mean? I'm now healing him. Mi nun sanigas lin. And I'm also lagging really, really, really badly. Like, oh my god, that was terrible. That was bad on a bad scale of like 1 to 100. Oh man. Okay. How do you say I must heal us? Mi deva sanigi nin. Mi deva sanigi nin. I'm gonna get that. I'm gonna get that. I'm gonna get that. Yes! <laughs> bon ege. Oh man. Oh shit. Oh, this is not good, this is not good, this is not good. Get up here, get up here, get up here, and heal, heal, heal. Mi deva sanigi min. Mi deva sanigi min. Okay, cool. <laughs> the stupid priest didn't even see where I went. <laughs> Woo! Straight out of here. So, mi fujas, mi fujas. Oh, 
Oh, oh, you're not going to get me at all. Okay, so how do you say, I just fleed? Me just fujis. Me just fujis. Oh, shivers, me timbers. This is going to get bad. Mm, no, you don't. Mm, no, you don't. Oh, maybe you do. Maybe you do. Maybe you do a little bit. Just like on a, a scale of one to really bad. This is getting bad. This is getting bad. This is getting bad. Nya, nya. You will not kill me. Vine Mordetigosmin. Vine Mordetigosmin. Oh, feck. Eble the Mordet. Ah, I Fudge. Fudge stickles. Okay. Well, that's it, guys. So I hope you've enjoyed this lesson. Um, I know this was probably not the most structured lesson, but I wanted to mix it up because I think some of you guys were getting a little bit bored of what I've been doing. So I'm trying a new new way of teaching you words. I will refocus on the same words I just taught in the next lesson. So if you've enjoyed this, give it a like, share it around with your friends, subscribe to my channel if you haven't already, and I'll see you in the next video. And if you're not there, well, you're not getting any of my heels. <laughs>